five matches left in the season. We have to play seventh. I'm going to go through them. Seventh, 19th, third, 13th, and 14th. A load of mid-table teams, but two very important games today against Doncaster and against Wrexham. Can we get the wins? Can we move clear at the top of the table? Let's find out. So here we go. We are facing Wrexham and then Doncaster. I'm going to skip the Bristol game because I don't think anyone really cares about that game too much. We've got a full squad. Everyone fighting fit and ready to go. Don't worry about all these. These are just the players that are coming on trial. It's a tried and tested team. We don't need to do anything stupid whatsoever. We are just going to crack on with this team. We're going to crack on with the performances. And we just need to grind a win. It's time of the season where everyone gets a bit nervy. People start losing games. Brentford are playing Bristol City, who we play next. I don't think Bristol City are safe as of yet. Winter plays it in. But oh, oh, I can never say that name. Okonkwo. Okonkwo makes the save. Ball booted up. Oliveira. It's now with Makoina. Makoina out to Quay. Quay, what is that for a touch? But oh, it's a mistake. And Emmanuel Winter is there to capitalise on it. The Welsh fall silent. The race course in hushed tones as the Annie Road go 1-0. Uh, <coughs> my throat is killing me at this point. Reading are not playing today. Neither. So, Wolves have gone 1-0 up against Blackburn. Winter whips the ball in and it's over the bar. Can we keep this level of performance up? That is all that matters. Brent, are Brentford losing? Are Brentford losing their, their game? And Sjotjak, Morris wins it back. Morris now, he's going to go on a run. He, he's, got, he's got the pace. He's got the banners on. And he passes it back to Riddle. Riddle now to Oliveira. Oliveira through to Marlowe, through to Winter. Winter, he takes his time. He is a cool cucumber. Emmanuel Winter doesn't care that please try and tackle him. He just slots it in. For a two-goal lead. No, Brentford also drawing. A loss here today for Brentford. The title becomes clearly in our... I think it's already clearly in our own hands. Unless they win the game. If they win the game, then it's not. If they don't win the game, there's a 15-point goal. 15-goal uh, difference. I don't think they're going to make that up somehow. Wilson tries to go and tackle him, but it's fun. Suchek and Suchek. What a goal. Marin Sotiak. I think he's on the Wonder Kid list as well with a phenomenal goal, which brings the race course back to life. I'm just having to tell players to calm down, stay focused. It's okay. And Thomas now plays it in, but Quay wins the header. It's come out to Sotiak. Sotiak. It's with Thomas. Thomas now. Bentley and oh, we've conceded from the corner. It's two all, and now we are going to berate them. That is berate. They need berating. What is going on? We have conceded two goals in this race of seven minutes. Winter plays the ball in, and Mitchell gets his fifth. My voice is going <coughs> quite quickly. <coughs> Oh, from the shouting, I can't shout anymore. But that is an important goal to put his 3-2 up. Uh, and just coming up to add it on time. I'm pleased that we are back in the lead. We just can't throw this away. That's all we've got to do is not throw this away. They're playing 4-2-3-1. The team is playing very well. They're all fighting fit. Everyone is ready and willing to go. We've got no issues there. Everything's looking good. Wow. That's happened out of nowhere. Uh, Oliveira. Now, Mitchell. Mitchell to Morris. Morris to Riddle. Riddle to Wilson. Wilson through a twinter. He's got time. He's got the space. He knows what he's doing. As long as that's on side, that is four to where two goes ahead again. Don't throw it away, is all I'm going to say. Just don't. Throw it away. Basia plays it in. Olivier is there. And he's gone for the header and he has absolutely 
mess the header up. And yeah, they are three 0 down. So I'm, I'm I'm quite happy with that. Can we get rid of this corner? Because we are struggling to get rid of them. Headberg, aim a headberg there with a phenomenal. It's going to happen again, isn't it? We go two goals up and they peg us back. So let's let's now make some changes. Trey Neoni is going to come on the pitch. Holloway is going to come on the pitch. Gilroy is going to come on the pitch. We're going to also bring on Rune Berge up front. And we are going to bring on Elise for Quay. There are five changes. We're going to make them all straight straight away. Now they've got another corner. Hey, Berg. Oh, and it's, it's that corner. And thankfully, it goes over the ball. Tensions are rising. Can we hold off for what is a vital, vital victory? Brentford have got one back, though. 47, 52, and 61, the goals. Berge delivers it. It's, it's not dealt with. Is he onside? Is Gilroy onside for his second goal of the season? He is indeed. Come on! That is what we want to see. 5 3. It's a hectic game. 87 minutes on the clock. McAllister. But oh, Elise wins the ball back. It's still only 3 1 in that game, but he loses it. Hedberg plays it up. Blackburn, I've got one back. Gilroy now to Riddle. Riddle takes his time. Find the pass. Poor pass. Hedberg wins it back. Not what we want to see. Popple. Now, Melonio. I think that is if he's Spanish. Back to Okawankwo. Okawankwo off. Riddle wins it. Holloway. Marlow. Neoni. Neoni. He's got time. He's got space. Shoot, man. Shoot. <laughs> to finish the game off. He puts it wide. Wolves still winning their game. Headberg. Plays it in, and it's, ooh, they've gone for the clue, the near post corner, and it has not worked for them. Seven minutes of additional time. Everything is going our way. Let's say it quietly. We are top of the league, and it is in our hands. We will be back for that important game against Doncaster. I'll see you in a moment. So here we go. This match, we're four points ahead, so we can't technically win the league today. But a win against Doncaster means that we will be in prime position to win the league next episode in the first game, which means then the second game, I can just play a load of the youngsters, not really care that much, and then go into the next week just for the Premier League. It has been a journey, and we are getting so close to the pinnacle of English football from level 14, I think it was, to the Premier League. We just need to make sure we don't lose. A, a draw will do. Just don't lose this game. That is all we have to do is not lose this game. Brown now. It's with McKinney. It's through. And oh, they're 1-0 up. They're 1-0 up. Doncaster have scored. And that is not what we needed. Basia. Now, Mokuena. Mokuena. Olivia. Quay. Quay, what are you going to do? He turns. He gives it back to Olivia. Mokuena through winter. Doesn't. Just doesn't get on the end of it properly. And the ball is played up to Pirano. Pirano. Now, Basia, Basia, Marlow, Marlow, Wilson, Oliviera, Oliviera back to Riddle. Riddle now to Morris. Morris, can he do something with it? He finds Oliviera, Oliviera to Wilson. Wilson now to Quay. Quay, he takes it past his man. He, he puts it in, but Winter's not tracking that way. Marlow, Quay, Winter, Morris keeps it alive. What's Morris going to do? Finds Marlow. Oh, it's bobbling around, but it is... Played out. How are are they play Brentford are drawing with Charlton. That's fine right now. Basia plays it in and Griffith just comes and collects it like it was nothing whatsoever. And the ball is now with Basia. Basia now 
to Makawina. Makawina to Quay. Quay, find the man in space. Plays it to Wilson. Wilson loses it with a poor touch. And they're going to break Kennington now. It's now with P- Piano, Irigaburum, Makati, Makati. What's he going to do? He's going to try and play it, but Oliviera wins it. Winter gets it out to Morris. Morris now. Found Winter should have kept running there. I don't know why Winter checked his run. Morris, he's running all the way. He plays it across, and Winter is there. Emmanuel Winter with the goal. Brings us back level. The Annie Road fans scream in the corner, and we are one apiece. What is happening in the Brentford Charlton game? They are not winning yet. Winter. Now, Kinneyborough, he came from us, Kinneyborough. Brown. Brown. Now to Edwards. Edwards. Would a draw see us. Would a draw see us up? 93, 88, 2. Five points with six left. A draw, a win. Caesars promoted. That is what a win does. Wolves are beating Reading. Reading are drawing with Wolves. McAtee, that pervert corner that I really dislike, dislike this year. So a draw does not see us promoted. A win sees us promoted. Quay. Mokowina, Mokowina. Now, Mokowina again. Takes it into the box. He shoots. Oh, it's a great save by Griffiths. He tries to kill low, but Griffiths gets down. Put this in now. Basia. Find a blue head. Now he finds Griffiths. It's a poor corner in the end. A very, very poor corner. And Brentford are losing to Charlton. Does this mean... What does this mean... I don't know what it means right now. Um, Loveland, Mackety, Mackety through back to Loveland, and that's a great save in the end. <coughs> My voice is really, really bad now. By Veron. I have no clue what any of this means. Uh, ball into the box. Veron does come and collect it. Wolves are beaten Reading once again. Riddle now plays it in. And it's, it's fumbled. But see, it gets his first goal of the season. What a time. To, his first ever goal for the Annie Road. What a time to get your first ever goal for the Annie Road. That, I think, that tastes like promotion. I, I don't know whether. 88 points. We were five, six, seven. We win the league here. As it stands. We're going to win the league. That is what is happening currently. We are going to win the league. Unless there's a goal in the Brentford game. For Brentford. Doesn't matter what happens in the Wolves game. A win sees us promoted no matter what regardless. It all comes down to that Brentford game. Are we about to be crowned champions? Is that what is happening here? And I haven't made any substitutions. I've been so focused. I haven't made any substitutions and we've got very lucky there. Right, let's quickly whack on the substitution o'clock. Uh... Gilroy can come on as well, and we'll make all, all those changes. We are champions of the championship! We are going up to the Premier League as champions, and it means tomorrow we have a transfer special. We have gone from level 14, from amateur divisions, to the holy grail the Premier League. Spending or investing only about 50 or 60 million pounds into the club. What a journey this has been. Oh. I can't believe we, we've done it this simply. We have been promoted every single season. And 
I am just, I am shocked. I am elated. I am a lot of goddamn things right now. But next episode will be the transfer special for the Premier League. Started from the bottom. You won promotion from the bottom to the top divisions. Holy hell. Wow. Champions of the championship. Uh, there's just no words. We get our budgets. I'm hoping for about 60 million. I think I can do a lot with 60 million. Ah, I think things are going to be a little bit tougher. That's less than what I already had. I had 36 million here. Oh, they, they just stripped me of, 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 of my money. Oh, right, okay. That is not great news. But we'll deal with it. That is the end of the episode and of the season. We'll be back next time for our Premier League transfer special. I hope you've enjoyed. Please leave a like, share and subscribe. I'll see you all very soon. Bye for now.